thanks for tuning in for another Essential RC Flight Test and today we're looking at another drone, we're looking at the FY919 Reaper drone from our friends at rcmoment.com. Now this is really an entry level drone, you can see it has these prop guards above the propellers really to ensure that little fingers can't get in and get damaged uh, when it's being flown but it comes with a 480p camera that transmits via Wi-Fi to your smartphone. You can control it via your smartphone if you load an app onto it or you can control it via the transmitter that comes in the box. It also has optical positioning and altitude hold functions. But let's not hang around, let's take the components out of the box. Let's see what we get. Okay, so this is everything that you get out of the box. So let's have a look at the Reaper drone first. Um, it's a pretty robust little thing by the looks of it, fairly solid plastic. I do like the fact they've got these prop guards on the top. Although it does say this is 14 years or older, I dare say some kids under 14 are going to end up with this with this type of drone. So it's good to see these prop guards on top. Um, they're not big propellers, but at full throttle, if you put your finger in there, but you'd get a nasty paper cut. So good to have something there to prevent that. Looking underneath. Uh, looks like we've got a sensor there, probably for the altitude um, uh, feature. And we've got the camera under here and the flight battery in there, which you charge up with the provided USB lead. And we've got four spare propellers in there as well, which is great. Then the controller. Uh, one thing about this is it's got a crazy number of buttons on, on this thing. Lots of uh, features. And I'm not going to be wanting to look down at the controller while I'm while I'm flying it so I'm gonna to have to look at the instructions and memorize where some of the key buttons are so I don't have to look down um, and it expands as well so you can put your smartphone in the middle here and watch that FPV that first person view the cockpit view while you're flying which is nice we'll definitely try that after downloading the app but so what I'll do first put some double A's in here which I need to do and charge up with the, the drone with the USB lead and we'll try flying this for the first time. Okay, so here we go, we're out with the Reaper and uh, we've uh, charged it up and uh, got put the, uh, the treble A's, actually they're treble A's that go inside the, the transmitter and connected via Wi-Fi using my smartphone and put it in the middle of the, the transmitter to hold it securely and we get a nice picture. Nick can see that if I hold if I hold it like that, you can see that we get this uh, if we want to connect connect uh, sorry control it using the phone we we can do that using that interface on the top otherwise you can see the video underneath which is quite cool and we're recording it as well. So here we go. So I'm going to put it in beginner mode to start off with and I just do one key to launch and we're away. So you see it won't go above two to three meters at the moment because I've got it in beginner mode. But then if I turn off beginner mode then away I can go. back down there we go
there we go hopefully you've uh, seen the onboard video there we got I think we got fairly high for such a small drone um, not bad uh, there's a little bit of a breeze and you I had to put it into high speed mode so that I could counter that and uh, move move against it but a fairly maneuverable little thing so good fun for such a, a little thing and it's uh, really meant for as a beginner drone if you've not used one before for orientation and to use the uh, FPV feature that you get with this so really really good um, look it up on rcmoment.com if you're interested in watching more essential RC flight tests then please subscribe to this YouTube channel if you like uh, if you're interested in news reviews and the occasional free giveaway then look us up on our Facebook group as well so thanks for watching this one see you next time